Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back to Pokemon Insurgents. Sorry about the last time, um, I didn't actually get to make it all the way out of the cave, but I did some off-screen grinding, and I think uh, everybody's leveled up to around 9 or 10-ish roundabouts there. And as you can see, I got my little uh, Kakuna following me. I nicknamed him Nightmare. <laughs> uh, if I seem a bit out of sorts lately, it's because lately... I've been thinking about making like a video explaining what I'm actually trying to do with the channel and what all I've been reading into. There's actually so much more to know than I really ever thought. And I've been reading a lot of articles about the search engine optimization tool. Oh goodness, thumbnail generation. Oh, what else? What else? Um, ad revenues, different um, sponsorships. There's so much knowledge that I just wasn't, I guess, I don't want to say privy because I know I'm not that fancy, but there's just so much knowledge that I really wasn't aware of. And I almost, I might actually make an apology video. I'm still debating that. Um, but if I do, I'll let you know. Oh, I've got Conan here. Conan, the barbarian. Hehe, <laughs> he's level 8 now. He's been pretty tough. He's really been helping me out a lot. As it turns out, I've learned a few things. Like, for example, that it might actually take years before I or the channel actually get noticed. There's a lot of branding that goes in with doing a YouTube channel, especially about gaming, with all the different competition that's out there. And if I was ever to even get noticed, I'd have to be extra special spectacular. And it looks like hmm, I'm just going to be about below average for a very, very long time, unfortunately. But I'm doing everything I can to learn as much and as fast as possible. As a matter of fact, just last week you've seen that I've now started using, very sparringly, mind you, the um, w um, time-lapse footage. Um, I've worked a lot with making proper thumbnails, they could be better. I've worked a lot with making uh, better outros. It's nice. I changed the channel art and the channel avatar. Um, I try to... Oh, I, oops. Nope, nope, not him. Uh, let's see who fights you. Ground. Ground. Weak against flying. But for some reason it doesn't work here. Yeah, it's like it doesn't work here. I just... I'm, I, I really just want to run from him. <laughs> Because for some reason, I tried using Peck with Nidoran because it's a flying move against a Cubone. And it wasn't very effective. Then Cubone hit Nidoran with Bone Club, ground type move against Poison. It was very effective. I took a lot of damage. Don't know what these glyphs are about yet. Gonna find that out later. But um, the thumbnails I'm still working on. I really like the ones for um, Creepy Pasta Park, especially the first one. The thumbnail of like the uh, what was it, blood fountain drinks? Well, blood fountain is what I call it. The actual name of it is something entirely different. I can't remember what it was, but it's really cool. Um, I don't know how good the Halloween special is going to be. I'm going to try to set it up sometime this weekend, because I need an actual little bit of time to set it up um, while I'm off work. Because, you know, I can't quit my day job. <laughs> I ain't making no money. I mean, you know, not this. I've read all sorts of articles about thinking about your channel as an actual business. You know, there's things you need to do to promote yourself and whatnot. And I find... Oh, oh, oh. Trainer detection radius. I guess I have that turned on. Now I finally notice it. Aren't you a little bit uh, young to be traveling with Pokemon? Nope. No, I'm not. Hiker. Kinman. So now, oh, Tyogre, Tyrogue, Tyrogue, wait, 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 uh, Poison Sting maybe? I don't know, he's fighting, is he super strong against Poison? Fake Out, what? Oh, good starting move, yeah, that's right, Tackle, huh, that's uh, not very effective, I'm probably going to switch him out. Yeah, he just can't fight at this stage before he evolves. 
Neither can Metapod, aka Mothra. Uh, let's see, fighting, let's go with... You've got Confu... well... Ah! Uh, oh, I forgot to tell you, I also switched out Batman. Because I already have Aldoween in the team, and he's part ghost. So I switched him out for uh, Conan, so that I could actually have him. Let's go with uh, Dragon, or Twister. With Drew, oh! <laughs> he, mu he must have known he didn't have anything he could use against me. Nice. Well, now you won't have any choice. Harden won't help you against Twister. Twister is a special attack, not regular attack. Haha, I believe. 128, hot diggity. No, wait, uh. Nah. Send him out. I guess I should have. I could have switched out a little bit. Like, I could have switched out for a second and given somebody else a little bit of addi additional experience. Uh. Maybe I'll confuse Rayum, and then if he survives, I'll switch out somebody so that they can get experience too. Let him finish him off. Okay. So let's switch out to. Give somebody else some additional experience. Yeah, see, I like it. They're all leveling out to about 9. I wish I could see who's about to level up. I'm sure he can... I don't know. Can he finish it? Can he? Because, I mean, Tyrogue is confused, but... I don't think he's that confused. Tackle. Yup, yeah, see, he snapped out. Now we're both just tackling each other to death. No! I hate the tackle battles. At least it's better than the hardened battles. Those are garbage. Whoa! Down to three. Well, that was close. <laughs> but my rewards for my effort are a level up. Not quite. How? 288 for f winning. My Pokemon were beaten through and through. You better believe it, champ. Oh, wait. You're not the champ. I am. I beat you. Ha ha. Ah, good. More experience. <laughs> That's what I look at them as now. I'm trying to make it out of this cave for this episode. Switch in. Let's do this real quick. Get you in there. I don't want to turn on the speed ramping, though. Like, because this game actually has a fast forward of its own, but I'm sure you already knew that. But it doesn't... It makes everything just weird, you know? It's not really... It's not really authentic, you know? I'm used to the old-style Pokemon games where... You know, when you grind, there was no hyper mode. You know, you, you, you grinded. You were in there. You had your little Game Boy on the A and B buttons. Just pressing them, bad boys. All day, every day. <laughs> and it was worth it. You know, for hours of entertainment. I'm going to take this fork in the path. Oh, it goes around. I bet you can break those rocks later on and get something out of them. And obviously go up these water paths once you get surf. So you have to go around here. Oh, there's a little path off here. There's probably an item down here. Yep, there it is. Pokeball. Good, I think I needed one. Yeah, I'm all out. So now I have one. Which I shouldn't be that low, but as soon as I get to the next town, which will have the next Pokemon Center, which will have the next Pokemon because they're all together, I'll buy a Pokeball. Nightmare! Get in there. I'm gonna start skipping these, like, random battles, though. Wait, no, he's ground. Baltoy's ground, not rock. I keep forgetting that. Ah. Stupid. Stupid. Ugh. Uh, I could use... See, uh, flying won't do it either. I don't know why. I'm not sure why. He's ground psychic, I'm sure. Confuse Ray messes him, up, messes him up really good, though. You know, back in the days when I was a kid, I used to have a theory that psychic Pokemon are actually confused from confusion longer than any other type, and fighting type is actually confused from confusion less than any other type. I used to have that theory, and it seemed to hold true in the old... Um, special yellow, red, and blue editions. It seemed to hold true there. 
But I, I don't know if it's still true nowadays. Ah, yes, I sense. Is this evolution time? It, uh, yeah! Watch and be amazed as he transforms into what he was truly meant to be all along. My worst nightmare. Seriously, I have a phobia against wasps. I can't stand them. Ugh. Why do I even have that in my team? I, I, I honestly... Oh, uh, I just, I don't like wasps. Oh god, it's behind me. Ah, no! Oh, you're so slow. That took you forever. Anyways, I think that's the rare stone. The mayor was ta oh, the rare stone the mayor was talking about over there. Over on the far right of the cave, you can't miss it. Oh yeah, that rainbow looking thing. My agents are in place. Ah, we've got enemies. Enemies! I assume you have the grunts here, too? Yes, and armed with our strongest Pokemon. Once we get rid of the auger, we'll finally be able to go about our plans uninterrupted. Mwahahaha! <laughs> Excellent. I'm really not a fan of Yurn, the first auger, while our enemy I could at least respect. Huh. Oh. Hmm. I think I read that wrong. Well, we won't have to worry about him after day after today, will we? I sense evil plots. Russo, those were cultists. Did you hear what they were saying? They were after the auger in Telnor Town. I can't believe we were caught up in the middle of this. We need to help. We need to go back and warn him. Who knows what could happen if we don't? We have to hurry. He might already have arrived. Quick, let's go. Whoosh! We've been teleported. Damien, Russo, you're late. The auger arrived five minutes ago. He's waiting for you in the town hall. Waiting for us? We ain't important. Well, I'm not. Russo, we have to hurry. These people from the cave are probably here by now. Going, hurrying, yeah, er, er, town hall. Is this town hall? I think it's town hall. Yep, it's town hall. I'm here. Hello, young one. I'm Yong. Yearn. Yearn? Yearn. Yearn. Our Aaron? Aaron. The second auger. Is the Jace Island? I'm sorry. Jarn? I'm gonna call him Yarn. Yarn? <laughs> it's nice to meet you. This is a wonderful town. What might your name be? Uh, my name's Damien, and this is Russo. Sir, we think that one of the guests here is one of those cultists. They might be trying to catch you. Dang. <laughs> He's not a Pokemon, they can't catch him. Unless, of course, they have a human Pokeball. That's disturbing. What are you, serious? Why did you say that? Oh my gosh, I am so... Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. Damien, what are you talking about? You're embarrassing us. Why is that? He's not... Wait, why is that? He's not wrong. Oh, <laughs> cultist. And who might you be? We are. Cultist, dun-dun-dun, <laughs> the big reveal. <laughs> Sorry. You foolish child, you ruined our trap. You'll pay for this. You'll all pay for this. No, we won't. No, we won't. <laughs> this is my chance to prove myself. All right, Russo, let's go. Oh, a double battle? I like the sound of that. Hmm, <laughs> bring it on, kid. You've just made a huge mistake. And it looks like you're mine. Feel the wrath of the abyssal cold. Oh, that's what they are. One of them looks like a rooster. Yay! Hey, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Ah, oh, so I fight mine and he fights his, huh? Okay. Abyssal cultists would like to battle. Abyssal, yeah. Abyssal cultists set out scrap. Oh, am I effective against you? Ooh, and they're high level. Okay. Normal, huh? Uh, let's try poison sting. If you see how effective that is. Oh no. So that's part poison. Whoa, 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 okay, at least he's not very effective against me. Maybe I should heal. Yeah, let's, uh, use an item. Bag, because I got plenty of potions that I picked up when I was running out of the, uh, the, um, area. And I didn't get the chance, oh yeah, I didn't get the chance to heal from coming out of the cave uh, over there. Is this, yeah, that's a better spot. Yeah, much better. Why did I put the camera over there to begin with? It's much better. Water gun! Ow! Well, that was a critical hit, so at least it's not 
too effective. Let's see how good Fury Attack is. I can hit five times. Come on, Fury Attack. Three. Not bad. Average. Ooh, nope. We ain't about all that. We'll wait to bring you back out until I find something that you're super effective against. Poison. Weak against ground move. Bone Club is what we will use. I just hope he lasts long enough to use it. Mmm, not good. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh, that's right! Poison water. I'm not gonna edit that out. I'm gonna leave that in there. Damn. Urgh. Okay. I need to confuse this thing. I can't have him hit me no more. He hits too hard. Okay. Confused. Fan attack. Whoa! Why? Oh, he's got that too. He's super effective against everything. I can't. I can't let him take him. I can't. I can't. I can't let him take out my main guy. Oh, okay. What do I have? Okay, these guys are different. Wow. I've never lost a fight against a grunt before. Jeez. Oh, I'm already on. Okay. Double kick. Of course, it's not very effective. Hmm. Okay. As long as he's still hurting himself from the confusion, I guess we have a chance, but... Let's see, I'm poison. He's got... So far, bubble. Water gun. Faint attack. And I think the last one was tail whip. Man. This game has a definite difficulty ramp. I, I like it. Let's try a flying type move. Hold on. Gosh, am I really going to lose against this guy? Oh my goodness, faint attack. Always with the faint attacks. I probably don't have enough time to go for focus energy and then peck. Let's just use peck. Oh, are you kidding me? What's this thing's defense? I'm not going to make it. <laughs> oh, hang in there. Hold on, hold on. Let me get let me get a potion. Uh, I'm sorry about this. How much time do I have? 10 minutes? Okay, we're good. Let's see. Whew. We are hurting bad. Okay. That's going to be a bubble. That's going to hit. Ay. Please don't double hit. Peck wasn't very good. Double kick wasn't very good when uh, when Rainbow Dash tried to use it. But at least it hits twice. Ah, oh, no. I've got to take... Who's... Nightmare's faster. He can get the hit in first. Okay, at least that'll help take him out. Fury attack. Okay, yeah, he can get the hit in first. Take him out. Then I can switch to... Whew! Then I can switch to Alduin. Yes. And he'll probably be effective against the next attack. Or the, uh, the next Pokemon. Horsey. Okay, so... I think that's basic water in this one. Uh... No. Whew. Okay. Is it water poison in this one? One way to fi find out. No! Not part poison, and it's poison. I'm almost guaranteed a victory now. That's good. Uh, before I get taken out, let us go on ahead and slow its speed down as much as possible so I always get the priority in attack. Because I'm pretty sure the next hit's going to kill you. Yeah, the next hit's taking him out. But at least now I'll be a little bit faster. I wonder if he can harden his way through it. Just freaking give him one potion, and then just... Hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Give him one potion, and then just let him harden his way through the rest of the fight. I'm sorry if you hate me for this. Whoa, whoa, where is he? Mothra. Yes. HP was restored, 20 points. He's gonna use Leer. Okay, my defense fell. Well, you're losing by poison, so... I'm going to win anyway. 
Whoa, where, where? Harden. There we go. <laughs> I'll probably just um, fast forward this part. Smokescreen. Don't care. Ha ha! Well, then again, bubble and water gun are special attacks. So, me hardening won't do any good. And I'm about to get taken out, so I'm going to switch out for someone that can survive a bubble beam. Not you. Uh, you probably can't, but I'm going to have to give it a shot. Maybe I can confuse him if I get priority attack. Or attack priority. Nope. I didn't get attack priority because I switched out. Oh, let us try the confuse ray. Haha. -ha. Get confuzzled. It worked! Done. 123. See, I told you I just need a little bit of time to get better with both the games and the videos. 154, level 10. Hey, I sense a level up. I sense an evolution. Childish impotence. You are nothing. Hmm. You think you're fancy? He thinks he's so fancy. He ain't so fancy. This, this is fancy. Come on! Done! Butterfree! It's pretty. I like its, I like its artwork in this one. Ugh, how could it be? No matter. We need to scram. We'll be done for if we get caught. Also, I need to do a lot more level ramping. I thought 10 would be good enough. It was not. It seems they've made a run for it. No matter. I'll catch them and bring them to justice. You have my word. Sorry for letting you two fight my battles, but I was curious to see how you would do. I'm very impressed. You two are very talented. I'd love to see you two again if you're passing through Halo City. Feel free to say hello. For now, though, I should return. I have business to attend to. Thank you for hosting me. You have a very lovely town. That guy's cool. I like him. Did he just compliment you? I think so. I think your foster mother is going to have trouble making you stay if that's the case. What? Damien, this is your chance to go on an adventure. You got an invitation from the auger. Himself. Yeah, I guess you're right. In that case, I need to get going as soon as possible. All my friends have already arrived at, Mid at Midna Town and are training at the trainer school. Hey Russo, why don't we race there? Midna Town is just on the other side of that cave we met in earlier today. You mean the one I was almost through before you interrupted me? Not salty. We can learn how to battle and everything there. See you then. Yeah, yeah, I was almost there. I was, I was, I was, I was getting there. I was this close, I think. I hope they're, I hope the army liked my gift. Thanks for being friends with my son, Damien. <laughs> uh, uh, sometimes I read things not right. Sometimes I English. Not good. <gasps> Run! Pocket Center. Ignore the fact that I just ran smack into the wall. That didn't happen. We restore your Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Oh, wait. I said I wouldn't read that anymore. I didn't read that. That didn't happen. Oh god, the giant hornet's behind me again. Since I have him evolved, I I don't really want to count him out, but I I don't like bees. Stoked for its next battle. Oh well, he's in a good mood. Taking it easy. Let me see now. Let me just check one thing. I mean, we got four minutes. Shoot. Uh, summary. He's probably got a good nature. Bug poison. Mild nature. Hmm. Special attack up, defense down. I don't think that's good. I have to look up my nature chart. I used to have it written. Well, I, I have it written down. I need to look it up. I need to go get that again. I think that's special attack up, defense down. Or is that defense up, special attack down? I have to look that up. It's been a few years. Give me a break. Well, it's been like a, a year or two. Bella was mad when I 
like got the name wrong of the last Pokemon game I played. The actual last Pokemon I game uh, game I played was Omega Ruby when it first came out. Well, about a year after it came out. But see, my issue with him is he's Bug Poison. Can I hang on? Can I actually go from one to the next? But yes, good. I st I still can. Uh, bug Bug Poison, Ghost Dragon, Poison, Bug Fly, Ground Poison. So I have too much poison on my team. And one too many bugs, I think. Yeah, like three poison and two bugs. I need to check on that diversity. We're not we're not seeing a lot of diversity, and that's that's sometimes often the Oh, found an item but dropped it. Oh is it still there? Huh. Well anyway. Um gotta make sure I save. But that's the thing about like um, dual types is often you wind up with types that are the same as ones you already have in your um, team, or at least until you catch a few more. Cause see, I had Batman in there, and he's Ghost Poison, but I already had Nidor but I already had Nidoran, Nidoran, and Batman. That's three poisons. And with Alduin in there, that's three poisons and two ghosts. You know, there's a lot of poison ghosts in that. But I'm running uh, low on time, so we're going to go on ahead and exit from the box. Log off. Walk out. And then we're going to do a quick save operation, just to make sure. Yes. Haha. -ha. Good. I think we're all set. Well, that's about all the time I have left for this episode, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, make sure to subscribe for updates on future content. Leave your comments in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated, and until next time, take it easy, my friends. Russ Robo here, and I just wanted to give a shout out to the awesome game Pokemon Insurgents. A Pokemon fan game made for fans by fans. It's an amazing game, and I've added a link to their uh, website where you can download and play for free. I hope you all enjoyed the episode. If you did, make sure to subscribe for updates on future content. Put some comments in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated, and until next time, take it easy, my friends. <laughs>